Hello, this is Morning Gallery. The artwork I will introduce today is the work of Joseph Rodifer de Camp. Joseph Rodifer de Camp, 1858-1923, was an American painter associated with the Boston School, a group of painters who sought to create an American style of painting that reflected the nation's unique culture and history. De Camp was born in Cincinnati, Ohio, and studied at the Massachusetts Normal Art School in Boston. He later traveled to Europe to study the old masters, spending time in Paris, Rome, and Venice. De Camp's early work was influenced by the Impressionists, but he later turned to more classical subjects and styles. He was particularly known for his portraits, which were highly detailed and often featured historical or mythological themes. In 1897, de Camp was one of the founding members of the Ten American Painters, a group of artists who broke away from the established art world to create a new, more modern style of American art. Throughout his career, de Camp was highly regarded by critics and collectors alike, and his works were exhibited widely both in the United States and abroad. He died in Boca Grande, Florida, in 1923. When appreciating Joseph Rodifer de Camp's work, it's important to pay attention to the following points. First, historical significance. De Camp was a part of the Boston School, a group of artists who sought to create an American style of painting that reflected the nation's unique culture and history. Appreciate his work as a reflection of this larger cultural movement, and consider how his paintings might relate to broader themes in American history and culture. Second, technical skill. De Camp was a highly skilled painter, and his works showcase his mastery of various techniques such as glazing and layering. Appreciate his work from a technical perspective, paying attention to the level of detail, precision, and artistry in each painting. Third, emotional impact. De Camp's paintings often convey a strong sense of emotion or mood, whether through his use of color, composition, or subject matter. Appreciate his work from an emotional perspective, considering how his paintings might evoke a particular feeling or mood in the viewer, or how they might relate to broader themes of human experience such as love, loss, or the passage of time. By paying attention to these elements, you can gain a deeper appreciation for the beauty and skill of his his paintings. How about starting the day with a cup of coffee and a piece of art? Have a pleasant viewing.